pretties what's up welcome back to my channel so today's video I'm doing a little what's in my bag I asked you guys over on Instagram if you wanted to see one and you said yes so we're gonna do one uh, before we get started anything that I mentioned that can be linked will be linked in the description box if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for watching also if you're new and you enjoy my content please consider hitting the subscribe button and leaving me a thumbs up if you enjoyed today's video. It really helps me out a lot. Um, or even if you don't enjoy it, you can leave me a thumbs down too. Any engagement is good engagement. Um, other than that, let's go ahead and just get straight into what is in my bag. So you guys know this bag was sent over from FL Fancy Bag. She has a little boutique on Instagram. I'll have the bag linked. And then also the purse organizer right here I found on Amazon. It took a little searching because most of them are the smaller size but I went ahead and got the XL and it actually fits perfect in the bag it's got plenty of compartments and it really gives the bag a lot of structure um, and I think this one was $27 I wish the color would have been a little more pink and not so peach uh, but it matches close enough so yeah let's go ahead and see what all is in the bag so let's go ahead and open her up um, I just got that new or organizer, so everything in here should be pretty organized. Um, this is stuff that I just added to it and switched out. So the first thing, of course, you can't go anywhere without your car keys. Um, these right here, I've just got a little Victoria's Secret keychain on here. I've had this one on here for a hot minute. It's probably time to change it out, but this is one of my favorite ones that they've ever came out with right here. I think they actually do still sell this online. If they do, I'll link it for you guys. Um, and then over here, I've just got a little keychain from Lovely Luxuries. This one is just a little macaron uh, key keychain right here, and it's got a little poof. And then I just recently started carrying this, especially since this bag is large and I can fit so much into it. So if I'm ever out and I'm wanting to um, like film a little shopping vlog or something, this little tripod right here that I found on Amazon is perfect. It's not really big, doesn't take up a lot of space, and it's cute. Um, I'll link this for you guys if you're interested. But I've been carrying this a lot here recently if I wanna um, film in the stores, and it just makes it a lot easier. And then of course, wallet. This one's a little Juicy Couture one. I found at Ross recently. Um, I usually switch out my wallets probably once a month. Um, and I've been using this one for a while now though. I like it because it's large. Of course, I love the little card holders too, but you can just fit so much in these. So you guys already know Ross is always stocked with Juicy Couture wallets and they're always so cute. But this is from Ross. And then we've got some gum. So my daughter usually comes in and steals my packs of gum if I ever have like a five pack. So I started getting uh, the little refillable right here. This is double mint. Of course, it's just about empty, so it's time to restock. But I only restock like half at a time because I already know she's going to steal half of it. So annoying. Uh, and then we've got our little sunglass case right here. We've got a little travel size of Juicy Couture perfume. This is the Lay Bubbly one. If you guys haven't tried this one, it smells amazing. It's one of my favorites. Um, I think this, I want to say it came out last year around Christmas time or my birthday actually, because my husband got me the bigger version. If you guys haven't tried it, here's what it looks like right here. It smells amazing. And look how pretty this bottle is. Absolutely recommend if you like Juicy Couture perfumes and you haven't tried this one, definitely try this one. Um, let's see. Then we've got a scrunchie because of course you never know when you might have to pull your hair up and then I always like to carry around a little compact um, and I've just been carrying around this little Too Faced hot cocoa bronzer right here um, of course I'm probably not gonna be bronzing my face while I'm running errands but I like to carry this one around because it's brand new and the mirror is actually clean so you can actually see when you're using it so we'll see how long that lasts like that uh, I've got another, or not another, but I've got a lip gloss in here. This is the Too Faced Lip Injection. Um, this one was from their Pretty Rich collection. This one is Pretty Pony. It's like the prettiest um, pink lip gloss ever. 
is what it looks like right here. So pretty and it smells so good. It's, it's got a really fruity scent to it. Of course, you can't go anywhere nowadays without some hand sanitizer. Um, I try to keep a little stockpile of these Victoria's Secret hand sanitizers right here because they're spray and they don't have a real strong scent and you don't have to just slather your hands and keep rubbing them. You can just spray it and go. Um, I've got another perfume in here for some reason. I don't know why, but this is actually a roller ball. This is the Juicy Couture original scent right here. Just Juicy Couture, I think. Was it Viva La Juicy? I don't know. First one they came out with right here. And I actually found this little roller ball at TJ Maxx for like $6.99, I think. Uh, I've got a lip liner because I am constantly touching up my lips if I'm going to be gone from the house for a while. Um, this one is one of my favorites. I need to restock because she's like half gone. But this is NYX and it's in Sand Sandstorm. Uh, I've got a little touch up powder brush from SL Miss Glam right here. Um, if I've got my little compact with me, my Too Faced powder, if I'm getting oily throughout the day, I'll just kind of touch up just a little bit. Um, and this brush is so cute. And speaking of powder, here's a little setting powder I like to use if I'm on the go. This is a Too Faced setting powder. Um, this is their primed and poreless setting powder, but this is the older version of it. I've got the newer version in my vanity. Um, so I just keep this one for an on the go. It's just like a translucent setting powder and it's got a mirror with it too. And then we've got another lip gloss. Um, this is a Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Lip Gloss. I honestly don't know why I have this in here since I already have one gloss, but hey, you can never have too many lip glosses in your purse, I guess. Um, and then another thing that I really love to carry with me, um, is a little eyeshadow palette because I don't know about you guys, but if I ever, if I'm doing a bunch of shopping, sometimes I get sweaty and your eyeshadow can start to crease or whatever. So I always like to have a little eyeshadow palette with me for touching up. And I just like the mini ones because they're super small. Most of them have basic colors that you can blend in. So this is a little Too Faced Christmas coffee palette right here. And I've just been keeping it in my purse for touch ups. And then we've got a little bling brush, eyeshadow brush for if I need to do my touch ups with that. We've got a cute little bow pen. This one is from With, With Love Shop. I'll link her shop below. Um, you guys have seen some of the stuff she sent me in the past. She has bags, keychains, all kind of stuff. Um, but I keep this little pen with me because it seems like anytime I ever need a pen, um, I end up searching my car for 20 minutes and I can't find one. And so, big long story, but I always like to keep a pen with me. Um, and then we've got another here's some lifesavers i've been on a lifesaver kick here lately that and jolly ranchers um and then i've got so i usually keep the lipstick i'm wearing that day and a go-to lipstick for me is mac blankety it's like the perfect nude um but i've got two other ones in here that are really good nudes that i've been carrying also this one they're both limited edition so you can't like buy them in store anymore but this one is from the Nicki Minaj collection. This one was pink print. This was one of the prettiest nude shades MAC has come out with so far that I know of. Love this one. I'm going to be so sad when it's empty. Um, and then I've got another nude one in here called MAC Calm Heat that I carry with me as well. This one's like perfect to um, kind of highlight just the middle parts of your lips, I guess you would say. Just a really not light nude shade. Um, and then we've got a little hair clip. I think that's everything. Let's see. Yes, that is everything. She wasn't as packed full as I thought. So yeah, that's everything for this little what's in my bag video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. You guys voted on Instagram um, and you said you wanted to see it. So I'll have the bag and everything linked again if you guys are interested and anything else that I can link in my description box as well. Um, and other than that, um, be looking for a video this coming Sunday. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I'll see you on the next one.